Do you love the new car smell? Is there such thing as a new boat smell? Stick around to find out if new boats really stink or smell good on today's video. Hi, I'm Sean from Lens Cove Lessons in Boating. And one of the things that we get asked on a regular basis is, should I buy a new boat and get all the corresponding benefits with that warranty, choice, ability to pick the color and options you want? Or should I buy a used boat and get the benefits of paying a lower price and possibly not getting the depreciation that you would on a new? So we answer the question all the time. And let's go over the cons of buying a new boat. You are in some ways at the mercy of the manufacturer. Boat manufacturers actually don't build many boats when it comes down to it. The market size of boats is way, way smaller than cars. They sometimes have supplier issues. Because they're a small player, they have to change what tower they might use. They may have to change what engine's available, what electronics they're going to use in their boats. Because of that, you may find that when you're buying a brand new boat, you are expecting something and you get something slightly different. That's a common issue. The other thing that happens is because it's a small volume, there can be little glitches with new boats. There can be gel coat issues if it's not properly laid up. Upholstery issues, uh, they're building small batches and everything is done by hand. So it's possible to get something that's not sewed correctly. So these little annoyances, which are covered under warranty, can rear their ugly head within the first year or two of new boat ownership. Typically speaking, when you buy a used boat, all those things have come out and those irregularities have already been dealt with. That being said, when you buy a used boat, of course, you are subject to not knowing a lot of things. And we'll get back to that later. There are some other issues with buying new boats. Obviously, you're going to pay a higher price and likely, depending on how long you own that boat, you're going to pay more depreciation for a new boat versus used. The question is, how much more? So if you buy a brand new boat and keep it for one year versus buying a five-year-old boat and keeping it for one year, there's no question that from a depreciation standpoint, the new boat is going to depreciate more than the used boat is from a dollar and percentage standpoint. If you hold your new boat longer, say five plus years, and you hold a used boat for five plus years, the depreciation is still more in the new boat, but it flattens out to the point where when you average it out over those five years, it's much closer to the used boat depreciation. So let's talk about some benefits. When you have a new boat and it's likely covered for about five years, your cost of ownership of that boat is significantly lower. What I mean by that, there will be no repairs and virtually no maintenance. Other than winterizing or seasonal maintenance like oil changes, realistically your new boat should require no investment in repairs and maintenance, where the five-year to ten-year-old boat likely will. And when you add in those costs, which are going to be more, it further brings the expense of a new boat down towards where a used boat is. It will probably on average when you take 10 boat owners who buy 10 new boats versus 10 five-year-old boats, they won't be identical. There will be some that the new boat was actually a slightly better investment and some that the used boat was a better investment. But what you'll find over that average of 10 boaters is that when you sell that boat after five years and you add up all the costs of fuel and maintenance and repairs and depreciation and put them all together, you're going to see very little difference in the new boat owner to the used boat owner. The key there is how long. If you tend to flip in and out of your boats all the time, it's a little bit more expensive because you are paying that depreciation over and over and over again. However, you get the benefit of a brand new boat. You know that it's covered under warranty. You know that you get, in theory, the choice of what color you want and what options you want. And you have no risk when it comes to how that boat was used before. A new boat is going to be hopefully for you from the factory or has sit in a dealership for very little time and you're not going to have to worry about how was the boat driven, how was it taken care of, was the maintenance done on time, were the repairs that were required done, has it ever sunk, has it ever been in a storm, was it you know abused by you know the young uh, children who borrowed the boat from time to time. So those things are taken away in a new boat. If you are unsure 
most people start with a used boat because they feel like that lower investment and lower risk of depreciation is a great way to get into the boat market. However, I would say that once people own a used boat, typically speaking, 50% of the time their second boat is new. And once people buy a new boat, if they do change their boat for a few cycles during their lifetime, almost always they continue in new. And that tells you something. So what do you think? Do new boats stink or do they actually have that great new boat smell? It's up to you. But what I hope this video did is help you decide whether new boats were the right choice for you. If you want to know a little bit more depth and detail on the boat manufacturing process and why they cost what they do, check out this video here that we made just not too long ago. Thank you for watching today's Lens Cove Lessons in Boating and we'll see you out on the water.